He said this is a, a continuation of a previous action, uh, previous question which I did put to Hazur uh, in the previous sittings. I would like to know that uh, Jerusalem, is there any significance uh, for Jerusalem in the point of view of Jamaat Ahmadiyyat, especially it was the first Qibla of the Muslims? <coughs> According to my study of the Holy Quran, or Qibla Awal as you call it, is extremely important <coughs> in many ways. <coughs> Sorry. One of the reason why it is so important is that it is designed to be handed over to Ahadru Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. In that way, there will be merger of previous Qibla with the permanent Qibla. The continuity, which was always meant by God. Ahadur was to stand at the summit of religious evolution. So this Qibla was also once the center of the world's attention. And it could not be kept separate because then the continuity of religious evolution would be broken in the middle. So as we discuss the question of uh, uh, Zul Karnan, this also, this question is also related to that. Ahazah sallallahu alayhi wa is going to m merge the two ages. The previous age with the new age which he himself has ushered in. So this Qibla, for the time being, stands in the way. And the Holy Quran has repeatedly mentioned it and proved it beyond a shadow of doubt that ultimately this Qibla will belong to Ahadur Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and his followers. This Al Ard is this Bath al You understand? So that is why I believe it to be a very important uh, issue which should be kept in mind by the Muslims. Unfortunately, they have turned the issue to a ter ter territorial issue. If this land is handed over to some Palestinians or Muslims, it will be just territorial. The significance of this prophecy will not be fulfilled. It can only be fulfilled if Allah's righteous people as a whole, the world of Islam as a whole, gains it and uh, uh, puts it under the feet of Ahadur Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam to belong to him. So that is what we are expecting will happen. But it will not happen through war. It will not happen through battles. It will only happen by the will of God because Allah has clearly mentioned in the Holy Quran that we will give this Qibla or the Maqbet al Maqdas to Islam. Which means the efforts of the people, which is material and corporal, will not count at all. Whenever Allah so decides, He will give this Qibla back to Islam. But then it's very important that we should. Uh, pray to God and all the world of Islam should be reminded to continuously pray that instead of uh, this happening in the future generations may Allah grant bless us to observe this happening in our own lifetime <laughs>